Hi everybody, this is Mary for Stampin' Camp with Mary and today is There's a Card Thursday. And I want to show you how to make a great card using um, a couple new stamp sets we have with the uh, new catalog. So what are we going to be using? Well, for the stamp sets, we are going to be using a cling set, Free as a Bird. And um, this is a photopolymer set, Floral Essence. What else we're going to be using? <clears throat> for ink, we're going to be using the Memento Black. We're going to be using Daffodil Delight Coastal Cabana. We are going to be using um, an eight and a half by five and a half piece of Coastal Cabana. We're going to be using a piece of Whisper White, uh, five and a half by four and a quarter, and a piece of um, Daffodil Delight, four and a quarter by five and a half. We are also going to be using glue dots, and we are going to be using the new Floral Essence uh, Punch. Um, it is in bundled with the stamp set. So, oh, and we're also going to be using blends, um, a different color blends, um, whatever you want, okay? Because you're going to color these in. So the first thing we're going to do is we're going to take the um, uh, branch of birds and we're going to stamp that on the Whisper White with the Memento Black. Let's see if I can get better lighting in here. So I'm going to do one down here. Then I'm going to turn it over and do another one. And then I am going to take my um, blends and I am going to color those in. Now I know you don't want to sit here for 20 minutes while I color those in. So um, I have already done one. So there we are. Um, what I'm going to do with that now, I'm going to um, put that aside. I am going to take my Coastal Cabana. I'm going to fold it as a card base and I'm going to take the leaf from the uh, free free as a bird this part of it and I'm going to take my coastal cabana and I'm going to stamp this all over the card front okay noisy campground you hear all the dogs it's Memorial Day weekend so that's when I'm doing this video so a lot of people around that off. I'm going to put that away. I need to get my washi tape. Find my washi tape. And there we go. And then what I'm going to do is with blue dots I'm going to attach this 
into the just like that to the daffodil delight and I'm just going to eyeball this I cut this down a little when I cut it off so it would fit nicely within that. Then I'm going to take my um, Stampin' Trimmer and I'm going to cut that again. Then I am going to attach that right to the front. Alright, like that. And then I'm going to take now you notice that you're going to put this in like that so you want the two ones down on the ends okay the two two of the leaves or the now I did buy some of the centers but I don't know where they are right now I've been uh, rearranging all of my stuff today since we just got this and so I don't know where all of my stuff is. And then I'm just going to take this and I'm going to line it up, punch once, line it up, punch again. Isn't that great? Uh, let me see, I think I have my, one of my bone folders in here. Oh, and I got some. Yep. Oh, I even got some washi tape, so I know what I'm going to do after this. And I am just going to curl these up just a little. And then I'm going to put a couple pieces of, a couple glue dots on there. You can put any adhesive you like. As you know, I love my glue dots. And I am just going to line those suckers up just like that. Put in a couple more glue dots on. Put that up front. It'll look really nice with one of those centers. And then I am going to take my The World Needs More of You and Your Friendship Means the World to Me. Let's do Your Friendship Means the World to Me. I'm going to take this off. And I am just going to stamp with the Memento Black again right over the background I did. There you go. Remember to follow me on YouTube. All the information is down below. I really would appreciate it if you uh, shop from me. Thanks for visiting and happy stamping. Bye-bye.